of the Green Party of Canada went down to the hunger strike protest in front of the BC Hydro building in downtown Vancouver to show her support for the striker Christine Henry. Um, I'm on a hunger strike because um, I am... Uh, sorry, I have just takes me a minute. Christine wasn't there. She's in hospital. Um, I'm on a hunger strike because um, we don't need the Site C Dam and the legality of it is still being challenged in court um, with the Treaty 8 First Nations in particular. And I'm, I'm concerned for her health, uh, but I think it's a very legitimate uh, and important way of expressing concern in a democracy. For me, the $8.8 .8 billion project is ignoring Treaty rights and First Nation people dreadful project environmentally, economically, and in terms of energy uh, is more important than treaty rights of First Nations. And this is bare flats, that's what's going to be flooded. The environmental this impact of ago. the project are real and it's already it's changing the Peace ago. River Valley landscape. Flooding half as much of the agricultural land that BC needs to support itself in food and they're just flooding it. Farmers from the region are concerned about the future of the Peace River Valley. Farmers have long-term jobs. Why aren't we investing in long-term jobs that actually put food on our plates, that actually feed people in our communities? Um, I think if we go through with this project, we're being short-sighted and we're throwing away such a beautiful future in the Peace River Valley. Activists hopes to send a petition to Justin Trudeau to stop the size C death. From Kirsten, it's a hunger strike petition. We're trying to get everyone to sign this. So many things we could be doing in British Columbia to generate more renewable energy. But Site C, again, the full purpose of the project is to provide energy for fracking of natural gas. The campaign against Site C is continuing until they get recognition of what they demand by the government. For Delaine Garavois, I am Roberto Teixeira, Vancouver.